my special birthday at the Magic Island Dive Resort in Cebu, the Philippines. This is a John's Retirement Travel Blog production. My birthday was coming up and I wanted to do something special. I mean special, I wanted a couple criteria. One, where the food was really good, and two, the scenery was really nice and pleasant. And so what came to me was the Magic Island Dive Resort. I've eaten there once before. The kitchen crew is great. The menu is many pages long with a lot of really good things. And the delivery of the food was, it was delicious. And you're right over the water. It's a very beautiful place. So that's where I decided to go. And I wanted to go with my good friends, my neighbors, who lived there over 20 years and knew the area well. And they knew this had the best food also. I had a feeling I should get there a couple of days ahead of time just to check out and make sure there's space available and everything, because it's a popular place. It's really well known in the dive community all over the world. It's not like a restaurant where people pull in the road and come to. No, it's sort of out of the way, but people fly in from all over the world to Cebu and they pick them up in vans and vehicles and bring them there so they have a great time diving. So when I got there and talked to the manager, I realized that, well, on my birthday itself, that one, there was going to be a power outage from the whole area, but two, they were totally booked up. They had groups coming in, so they really didn't have a lot of time. But if I wanted to come the day before, um, they had groups coming in later in the afternoon and people leaving earlier. So there was a few hours we could have the place to ourselves. And I decided to go for it. I didn't really care which day it was or not. But it was nice having that there and working that out ahead of time. And I told them it was my birthday, and so they you know, wanted to be nice to me and give, make sure I had a good time. And I am a neighbor, and we do live in their neighborhood, which I'm happy to say I enjoy. Now you can start seeing the table that we had right over the water, um, just for the four of us to enjoy the afternoon and the ocean and the boats. It's a wonderful day. And there are other dive boats that are around. And here is our table. The first page of the many page menu does tell us that everything is made fresh and if there's something you don't see here, ask us. We could probably come up and make that also. Japan to Canada. Oh, oh, okay. 
There's a picture of the massage structure where they do massages in over the ocean. The distance is a boat for the Turtle Bay Dive Resort. Different colors, the four of the white, <laughs> purple, yellow, brown. I'm gonna take pictures. Wow! Happy birthday to you. Wow. Thank you so much. Happy birthday to you. I wasn't expecting all that. I did tell them it was my birthday, but I didn't even order cake or anything. But they came out with that, the whole kitchen crew and management showed up. I was felt quite blessed. It was quite impressive. Enjoy your lunch. Magic Island boat. Yeah. Oh, the diver is. Yeah, I love the view from here. And these are the stairs down to the dive shop. An inside view of the massage room overlooking the ocean.
The total came to around $54 for the four of us. They didn't charge us for the cake. Then I walked by the regular dining area to check it out. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. A pool is important for a dive school so you can practice things underwater. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video and please hit the subscribe button.